everybody, my name's Jammin' and we are back playing some Minecraft in the cobble road. And of course my world is loading like a stupid, slow, stupid head. But we are back and uh, got a good suggestion from from one of one of our viewers, a guy by the name of Jack or Jack O T eight. Jackot? I'm not sure. Jack, I don't know how to say your name. Sorry, man. Uh, but he suggested in this house, why not change some of the wood so that it is a different uh, different style? So I think I might do that. Add a couple of these jungle wood planks in there. Just to kind of give it a little bit more of a... Man, come on. It's not where I told you to go. A look of being disused. I thought maybe even throwing one of these up to show that it has become very, very warped. I don't know. I think it's pretty neat. I think that's a great idea. Jacko, good idea. Keep them coming, man. I appreciate. Why not? And, uh, you know, I was even thinking, let's go a step further and let's put some wood down here. Because cause why not, you know? Some of oh man, I can't believe it. I'm so bad at placing this stuff. Come on. Nope, no, nope, we're about to drown. Yeah, drowning is good. Drowning is fun. But you know, this makes it look a little bit more like some of the wood has fallen down to the bottom and I think that's kinda neat. I think that's really neat. So hope you guys enjoyed the last episode. Oh look at all these dead skeletons. I will take those arrows. I haven't really had to make very many arrows yet since playing. I uh, hope you enjoyed the last episode. Uh, sorry it's been a little while since I've put up a Cobble Road episode. I've been very busy with real life <laughs> and other things. Uh, as you know, my girlfriend just started school, so there hasn't been much time for us to hang out. So when, when we get that time, we kind of have to take that time, you know? Also, I've been busy with work and... Uh, that's nice. I like that. Damn. Terrible jump. And of course, I've been working on a couple of other series. I'm sure you guys have seen uh, the Black Mesa videos I've got up. Um, uh, if you don't know much about it, Black Mesa is the remake done completely independently uh, by a group of guys um, in the Source engine. So updated graphics, completely redone worlds, like everything is, it's the same maps basically, I think they changed a couple of things, but it's essentially the same, the same game, it's Half-Life. But uh, I've been enjoying that, that's a lot of fun, it just, it eats up a lot of hard drive space, so when I record Half-Life, ha or when I record Black Mesa, I have to render and upload the videos before I can start recording anything else because the file sizes are so large for me to keep it good quality. Anyway, hope you guys have been enjoying. Today, we are going on a bit of an adventure. That's right. Stranded on this land, all alone, nothing but the remnants of civilization around him, Jammin decides it is time to move forward. Can only stay in one place so long before you have to discover new lands. And new lands are exactly what we're going to go and discover. The jungle lay before him like a, an iron curtain. A curtain of green iron. <laughs> I don't know. But we've got to go and find us a, a place to call our own. <laughs> Little cave right there. That's neat. I like that. Because right now... What is that? What is that up there? What is going on here? What is this? Look at this. Some sort of... There's something behind there. Where are we? This is this is a strange thing for a jungle. What's, what's going on here? Let's, uh... I think we may have found something. Lost, alone, with nothing but a crashed ship in an abandoned village. Oh, look at this. We discover what seems to be some remnants of something else that was here before. This is pretty cool. Hey, guys, look at this. It's like there was a road here at some point in time or another. 
a sweet little overhang right into the... Oh, I like it. This is super cool. Let's move on. Cobblestone everywhere. Jungle leaves. Nice little path through the jungle. There must be something at the end of this. Look, it goes on. Look at that. Wow. Let's go down. Cutting through the forest. With his trusty axe. Trying to find a new place to call home. It looks like someone else might have called this place home. That has a vague similarity of a of an old old style house or something. Hmm. Long abandoned, I imagine. Carry on down the road, and what do we hear? It's just a cobblestone pillar. Okay. Cool. Oh, more cobble. A nice little beach. Anything over here? No. This is this is a nice little beachfront property, though. A little pond there, I guess. Moving on, moving on. What are we coming up to? Looks some kind of structure. I don't know what that is. You guys know what that is? I don't know. But down we go and... Oh, look at this. This looks like some kind of pillar. More of this stuff all in a line. And Oh, man, look at that. This log fell over top of a little river here. What is this river? It's coming from this cobblestone structure. It's just covered in vines and mossy. This is crazy. And the world will not load. Thank you. This is neat. I think we found our spot, guys. <laughs> surprise, surprise. Jamin knows where the secret stuff is. Hmm. Wonder how that works. This is cool. So it looks like someone, at some point, set up... Must be an aqueduct? Going up to this little barren cliff up here. Wonder what's up there. Is there anything up there? Can we get up there? Yep. This looks like as good a path as any. Up we go, using the vines to our advantage. Yep, definitely some kind of aqueduct. Look at this, guys. Just a completely flat area at the top of this jungle. And over on this side, minus the world not frickin' loading, we've got an ocean. How cool is this? So I think this is going to be the spot where we build our new home. Oh, world, please load. Oh, I'm getting so fed up of this. Thought I bought a good computer, and here it is having the hardest time in the world loading a freaking Minecraft realm, world, thing, map, whatever. Oh, if only it would load faster. Hold on one second. So I guess the world loading errors come in play with uh, with fraps. It just takes too long to cycle through or something. I don't know. It's kind of a problem, but we are here. We need to do a little bit of terraforming, I think. I'm just going to cut this down so we've got a bit more of a flat area to kind of get started. Now, I don't have the materials to do this build at all. <laughs> So, I'm going to have to go and collect some stuff. Actually, you know what? No. We're moving on to a new area. This is going to be our new home. No longer living inside of a sunken boat. So, we're going to need a new place for resources, I'd say. I think at this point, it might be prudent to go and find a new cave. And in the process of finding that cave, we'll be able to find ourselves a way to get some some materials for the build here. Anyway, let's light this up so that it's a little bit safer. So at least we've got this high point in this jungle of doom, because no doubt at nighttime this place is going to be deadly. Just disastrous. And the sun sets, and we are soon to be in a great deal of trouble. But to hell with it, let's go. Hup. Oh, yeah, look at that. Climbing vines like a boss. So what do you guys think about this? This little little jungle bit here. I'm going to, you know, this is a little bit of out of character, but the next episode is just going to be a short one, and it's just going to be detailing how I made that stuff, the, uh, the aqueduct um, and all those little jungly bits. Whoa! 
Okay. Well, we didn't have to go very far to find ourselves... Oop, train going off in the background. You guys hear that? Wow. It's just hammering on that horn. Let's go down. Please don't tell me it just stops. It just stops. Well, that's okay. I imagine that around here somewhere, there's going to be a cave. A continuation. But this looks like a pretty good spot. Yeah, let's make a little pool here. So we don't have to worry about that. Yeah, this looks like as good a spot as any to start digging down. Uh, really, all I need to do is get a ton of cobble, so... I'm going to... uh oh, missed that one. I'm just going to start digging. Dig out as much of this as I can, and you know what? I think I might kind of go with the natural shape of this, and dig down, make layers down like it is now. But I'll come back to you in a little bit when I have got some materials, and we can actually start making a little uh, a structure for ourselves. Uh, I'll be back with you guys in a second. Alright guys, we're back. I've got a bunch of building materials now. Look at all this. Went and harvested a ton, a ton of cobblestone. And I measured it myself, so I know it was actually a ton. Just before you start chirping and saying, Oh, jamming, was it actually a ton, or was it more like... 15 pounds or whatever whatever screw you guys I do what I want but we're gonna start laying out our build here and it's <sighs> I'm not too sure what I'm gonna do it's kind of a complicated spot if this hill were bigger this would be super easy to do but since it's not I am not too sure I've just kind of been pacing around the outside of this hilltop to get an idea of what we're going to do. So I'm going to get some dirt on my bar. <clears throat> Pardon me. Just ate some lunch. It was delicious. A wrap with a fruit smoothie. Compliments of my girlfriend. She's a wonderful lady. Um, what, what are we going to build? What are we going to build? A tower, maybe? Going straight up to, to cloud level? I mean, that would be kind of cool to be able to see over the entire jungle. But this is going to be a little bit of an area. I think eventually this is going to get kind of fenced off to some degree. Like, I think maybe starting over at the water, fence off towards maybe the end of the aqueduct. And have maybe a wall underneath the aqueduct so you can't get through that way. I'm not too sure... But I would like to do things a bit more interesting than normal. Uh, yeah, 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 okay, I think I have an idea. We're going to start right here, right here. And we're going to go up, and it's going to be a gradual, a very gradual um, angle, I guess. <clears throat> Pardon me, all the coughing and choking the world right now. I can't breathe right now. Uh, but this is going to be an interesting design if it pans out. I don't really know how it's going to go. Like I said to you guys, I really, really don't know. Uh, let's start making it three. Three. And so this is meant to be built by a single person because we are the ones building this this is not something we have found here <clears throat> this is actually like us the survivors building some sort of crazy tower some sort of you know stronghold that we can survive in no matter how bad the odds no matter how many enemies there are something that we can survive in so let me count here for a second one two three four Five, six, seven, seven, eight, nine. Is nine enough? Nine might be enough. But I do drop down two there. So this is going to have to go three, four. Okay. Yeah, nine might be enough. We don't need it. We're not building the most gigantic building in the world here. 
I'm uh, just going to get a little bit of a framework, I think, for today. There's not going to be a whole lot of time. I think we're already about 15 minutes into this episode. And bring on the rain. Lovely. Lovely. We're about 15 minutes into the episode, and I don't want these episodes to go on too long. Like like last time, episode 4, I had to split into two episodes because it ended up being so long. It would have been like a 45-minute single episode, and that is way too much. I don't have enough time <laughs> in the day to record that much for every single episode I put out there, you know? Is this wrong? This feels wrong to me. So that's three. So we should be on the same level. We screwed up somewhere. How could you guys let me down on this one? Where did I screw up? It's all three. Was it? Is it here? Did I screw up here? No. Did I even screw up? <laughs> Let's go find out. I'm going to have a lot of dirt to clear away from this thing by the time it's done. So this is going to be the first big build, and I'm sure there's going to be a few big builds. I do love the building aspect of Minecraft. It's one of my favorite things about the game. It's one of the reasons I got so hooked in the game in the first place. I feel like I... S you know what probably happened? I think I know what happened. We gotta bring it down a little bit. Whoa, that was close. That was very close. I think I just missed one of the two high sections. So like right here. Yeah, that's about right. And then we start the three high sections. One, two, three. Um, but I'm hoping I can get the outline done so you guys have an idea of where I'm going with this build. Let's see, can we bring it back across now? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Perfect. Uh, yep. Then what we're going to want to do is from the middle point. Is that it? No. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. This is the middle point, sorry. From this point here, we're going to want to bring it out to the sides. To the sides! And uh, for this one, honestly, it's just going to be that typical circle type shape, but slanted. And uh, the reason it's slanted, I think, is because... We're no masonry specialists, whatever. We don't work with brick for a living. We're just, we, for all I know, the guy that we're playing as is just a fisherman. You know, he's just <clears throat> shit out of luck that his boat happened to be the one that crashes. But he's making the best he can, and he's going to build this structure despite the fact that it is probably going to be lopsided as all hell. <laughs> Is, uh, is that right? Did I get that right? Sure, we can do it like that. So it's not going to be a perfect circle. I think that's kind of neat, though. Uh, a lot of people tend to have a hard time designing circles. And I used to as well, but I just kind of said, you know what? You're never, ever going to make a perfect circle in a game that is made up of squares. You're not. It just doesn't work that way. So, instead of trying to make a perfect circle, what I tend to do is try and find an interesting shape. Like I guess it doesn't need to be perfect, because perfection is so overrated in this game. I mean, if you guys like any of the building stuff I've done so far, it is the least perfect you'll ever see. In fact, I'm destroying things most of the time, rather than actually building it. Uh... I mean, first I built that aqueduct, and then I had to spend some time tearing it down to make it look disused and old and 
I think it's a really neat style to actually take the time and the effort to go in there and make things a bit more interesting than just your typical, here's a house I made, it is made up of a square. You know? This game is a lot more than just squares to me. It'll always just be a bunch of squares, man. Just a bunch of squares. No, that's not true. Minecraft, don't listen. Don't listen. Don't listen to the people. You're not a square. You're the coolest. <laughs> so there's our top, but I think we're just about out of time for today. Here's one thing I didn't consider getting down, but no problemo. And we can do these other sides by simply one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, yep. Yeah. Wait a second. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah. Three, four, five. Okay, so that's our middle point. So we need to take it another. Oh shit, what were the sides? One, two, three, four, five in total? One, two, three, four, five. Right here. And then this one. One, two, three, four. Right there. So that one's gonna have to be built up a little bit to catch up. But that's okay. That's only, what, two blocks? Yeah, no problem. So let's do the same. Let's make our slanty tower. A whole bunch of twos and then a three at the top. Now, I haven't really tried too much of building and talking on camera at the same time, because it is really hard to do. Uh, but it is something I'm going to have to practice at if we're going to keep doing this series together and enjoy it together, instead of me just talking at a bunch of people who kind of like it. No, I want you guys to actually like it, to really enjoy it. And I'm going to do my best to keep on improving the skills that I have. Now we change to three, yep. And like, I've never done a build like this before. This is, to me, this is something completely unique. One, two, and three. Yep, okay, that's right, that's right. So let's go back down, let's finish up the other side, and then I'm going to have to end the episode and figure out on my own how this tower is going to get built up. Now, you can feel free to leave in the comments some suggestions and ideas about how you think the tower should go, but be warned, there's a good chance that I'm going to record the next episode before this one gets uploaded. Yeah, there's a good chance that that's going to happen. Because I need to get a little bit more of this hammered out. Because obviously so far you've just watched me build the exact same pillar up four times. <laughs> uh, and I can't be doing that every single episode when I'm building with you. So... Feel free to drop some ideas. I may have already come up with my own conclusion to how the walls of this is going to look. Are going to look, I should say. English, hello. Um, but yeah, feel free. I, I love the comments and suggestions you guys have been leaving so far. It has been a dream, in all honesty. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Now I'm not going to be able to do that. Okay. Here we are, here we are. Can I take out any of the dirt as I go? Yes, I can. Let's do that for this one side. Take out all the dirt as we go down. And we'll go step back and take a quick look at what we've done here. But then I'm going to have to end the episode quite abruptly. Hit it. Hit it. Ouch. Okay, cool. So why don't we go on down below, down below, and hope that this creeper does not see us. Oh, he sees us. He for sure sees us. <clears throat> Took a little damage there, but that's okay. Sometimes it's not so bad to take a little bit of damage. And we need to light this place up, man. I haven't, <laughs> I haven't even lit up the path yet. So this is a dangerous spot to be. There's going to be mobs left, right, and center. And that is bad. That is very, very bad. I didn't even see that zombie. <clears throat> did you guys see that zombie? Why didn't you tell me? Why did you not tell me? Damn it. Okay. So that's our slanted tower. Now from this angle, it's not much to look at, I imagine. 
but if we go around this way here a little bit hey cow get out of the water do as I say let's climb this tree and take a look see if we can actually get a view that is not obscured by everything in the world oh nice jump jamming nice jump jamming okay well we can't really see you guys are gonna have to take my word for it for now but feel free to leave some comments with some ideas what you think I can do to improve what you think of the idea so far and about how your day's going let me know how you are you hear too much about me tell me about you Anyway, that's it for this episode. My name's Jammin. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye for now.